I think it's going to be better for the environment if we make that move, um, but not really that big of an impact, nutritionally speaking. Um, I probably couldn't tell the difference taste-wise, but if I knew that they were doing that, I feel like I'd feel a little bit better, just like it'd be fresher, I guess. There's uh, the Mindful Heart Apple logo that we have in all of the dining halls. Those are your healthy options. They have to meet certain nutrition criteria in order to be considered mindful. I, mean, I think it would be better if they had like healthier options. Like I know that they do have like salads and fruit. Uh, I don't like to eat a healthy food. I don't think it tastes good, so you don't have to do that. You get, you form your nutrition habits, your eating habits, and they solidify around this time in your life. Um, so if you don't make those changes now, chances are you're either never going to make those changes or it's going to be a lot more difficult in the future. They offer uh, plenty of vegan options and like good like vegetables. Yeah, there's lots of options. Yeah, so. It's just like, it's just, it's up to the student. Like, I don't know, I just wish that they would have maybe like better options instead of just like a lot of candy and a lot of sugar, a lot of soda, stuff like that. Once you're off in the real world, you have to be able to seek out those healthy things and here you have everything that you can pick from when you have that ability to choose healthy but we can't tell you you know don't eat the hot dog don't eat the lunch meat mm -hmm. um, you have to learn to make those choices mm -hmm. and if you don't learn them here will you ever learn them